viewers welcome back to ahmed coaching this is dr anam and today's lesson is about structure and function of mitochondria to explain the concept of mitochondria i have here some batteries which are attached to these bulbs and these bulbs they are present inside a jar the batteries they have the power and this power when given to these bulbs the bulbs they will glow and then these bulbs inside a jar will enlighten this jar here let's on this you can see here the batteries they are giving power to these bulbs and then this whole jar is illuminated similar thing happens inside a body or inside a cell for example this jar is a body these bulbs they are cell and these batteries they are mitochondria the mitochondria inside a body just work like the batteries it is a powerhouse which gives the power to the cells and then the cells they perform their function by using that energy and all together these cells they combine and then give the whole body energy and performs different functions for the body i hope this thing helps you to understand the mitochondria concept now let's go towards the theory the mitochondria word is made up of two words mito and chondria mito means thread while the chondria word comes from the greek word chondrion which means granules mitochondria was first discovered in 1856 by albert von kolliker who studied the mitochondria Mitochondria is a double membrane bounded organelle it means that it consists of two membranes outer membrane and inner membrane Mitochondria is known as the power house of cell as i told you that it is like a cell which gives the power to the uh, animal cell or the plant cell that is why it is called power house just like the battery now the structure of mitochondria mitochondria is made up of outer membrane here you can see this is the outer membrane of mitochondria the function of mitochondria outer membrane or in a, in other word the outer membrane it is also known as outer mitochondrial membrane this mitochondrial membrane it has small pores in it or the protein name as porins the function of this protein is allowing the movement of small molecules in and out of the mitochondria the molecules they will pass through this porin protein and they will come inside the mitochondria and if these molecule wants to go out again through the porin protein they will go out of the mitochondria so the outer membrane it is involved in the movement of ions in and out of the mitochondria along with this the outer membrane also contains enzymes and these enzymes they are involved in the fatty acid elongation along with this adrenine oxidation all these are present inside this outer membrane between the inner membrane and outer membrane there is one space present which is known as intermembrane space the intermembrane space is responsible for the regulation of respiration respiration is actually the generation of energy by the breakdown of glucose in the presence of oxygen after the intermembrane space comes the inner membrane this inner membrane contains enzyme atp synthase whenever you find as word at the end of any word you can recognize that this is the name of an enzyme atp synthase synthase synthesis as mean it is enzyme so 
द इंजाइम्स प्रेजेंट इन द इनर मेम्ब्रेन दे आर रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द सेंथसिस ऑफ ए टी पी ए टी पीज आर फॉर्म्ड फ्रॉम ए डी पी ए डी पी दे आर कन्वर्टेड इन टू ए टी पीज एंड ए टी पीज आर एक्चुअली एडिनोसिन ट्राई फोसफेट एंड द ए टी पीज आर एक्चुअली द एनर्जी करेंसी इन साइड अ सेल इट मीन्स दैट इफ सेल नीड्स एनर्जी द सेल इज गोइंग टू यूज ए डी पी एंड दैट एनर्जी स्टोर्ड इन साइड द ए टी पी विल बी यूटिलाइज बाय द सेल फॉर द um for different kind of chemical reactions or some kind of synthesis after the energy is utilized the atp is converted into adp that is adenosine diphosphate similarly when the adp is needed the adp is converted into atp so this cycle goes on inside a cell the other function of inner membrane is the transport of proteins the proteins which are produced inside this area it's transported out of the inner membrane so the function of inner membrane is the transport of proteins the inner membrane is not as smooth as the outer membrane here you can see there are so many curves or folds inside the inner membrane it is just like the like the wrinkles present on the skin these wrinkles or the curves or the foldings they are known as cristi the function or the benefit of cristi is it increases the surface area because of the increased surface area more respiration it can take place inside the mitochondria the concept of surface area you can uh, understand through for example we have this one cube and then we have so many cubes together if one thing wants to go to in this cube it can go from here from here from four directions that molecule can go inside it means it has high surface area in case of this cube if something wants to go this to this cube that thing should pass through this cube or this cube this cube or this cube it means to reach the center of the cube this molecule requires a lot of time it means this cube has reduced surface area when the cristi increases the surface area of the mitochondria it is very helpful for the respiration it means more respiration more respiration means more atps more atps mean more energy the other structure present inside the mitochondria is the matrix the matrix is the inside space of uh, the mitochondria and the function of this matrix is that aerobic respiration takes place inside this space you can understand the concept just like the cell has this inside space which is known as cytoplasm in which so many reactions takes place similarly in the mitochondria the chemical reactions which in the case of mitochondria is aerobic respiration takes place inside this matrix the matrix consists of rna ribonucleic acid dna deoxyribonucleic acid enzymes and ribosomes the ribosomes which are present inside this matrix are responsible for the protein synthesis along with ribosomes the uh, mitochondria it has circular dna this dna is known as mitochondrial dna or for short form mt is used mt dna means mitochondrial dna the mitochondrial dna is responsible for the synthesis of enzymes used for the respiration or used in the pathway of respiration or in the aerobic respiration or the krebs cycles 
because of the presence of this empty DNA the mitochondria is a self replicating organelle self replicating means that it can replicate convert from one to two DNA and by self it does not need any help from the outside but it can produce its own DNA or it can convert one DNA into two DNA by itself so it is a uh, self replicating organelle that was the structure of mitochondria let's talk about the function of mitochondria the main function of mitochondria is ATP synthesis as we have already discussed that ATP is an energy currency which is used for the energy of the cell and this energy is used by the cell for different chemical reactions. In other way, if the mitochondria are absent inside a cell, that cell cannot generate the energy. And if the energy is absent, the chemical reactions, they will not take place. The second function is heat generation in brown tissues. The number of mitochondria is very high. More the number of mitochondria means more the ATPs. More ATPs mean more heat. So, in brown tissues, the mitochondria they are responsible for the heat generation or keeping the body warm. As I told you, that ATPs they are very important because they provide energy and because of the energy, the chemical reactions that takes place inside a cell. So. If the mitochondria are not present, it means the cell may die, so they are associated with the cell death or apoptosis. The last function of mitochondria is that it stores and releases calcium ions. It means that inside the mitochondria, the calcium ions, they are stored and when the body needs the calcium ions or when the cell needs the calcium ion the calcium ions they may go out from the mitochondria into the cytoplasm that was all about the structure and function of mitochondria i hope you understand this lesson if you like this lesson then gives it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel and also hit the bell icon to keep yourself updated with my videos and also, if you have any suggestion or any comment, just write it down in the comment section below. Thank you very much.